Another result of the drought, many Louisiana ranchers who have plenty of hay are shipping bales to the north and west. However, there is a restriction many are just now learning about. To ship to some of those areas, those bales must first have a certification stating that they are free of fire ants. This week in Louisiana Agriculture's Avery Davidson explains. Fire ants can be a pain, literally because they sting, figuratively because they're difficult to eradicate. Now many ranchers who want to sell their hay to their counterparts impacted by this year's drought are learning another reason why fire ants really are a pain. Anybody that's from the south knows how serious a pest fire ants are. We don't want to be transporting fire ants and establish them in a part of the country where they're, they're not established. Alan Fobb is the administrative coordinator for the Louisiana Department of Agriculture and Forestry's nursery and apiary programs. And in this case, he's just the messenger, reminding ranchers that there is a fire ant quarantine in place. The federal government is trying to keep the fire ants contained within that quarantine area. And that's why there's restrictions on shipping products out of that area. One of those products is hay. Here is a map from the USDA which shows the fire ant quarantine area. As you can see, all of Louisiana is within the quarantine. Fob says there is no restriction on shipping hay within the quarantine, but if you want to ship hay to any county not highlighted in red, you must first get agents to certify that the hay is fire ant free. The day that you bale it, it has to be picked up either on a trailer, on top of other bales of hay, or some other impervious barrier to the ground um, and it has to be done that same day if it's on the ground for more than 24 hours it can't be certified to be fire ant free. Fob says there is a cost associated with certification. You have to pay $161 if the load is worth more than $1,250 and you only pay $61 if that load of hay is worth less. The test is done by having an LDAF agent place food on the trailer for an hour. And if no fire ants come to it, we will certify the hay to be free. And you'll be free to ship it wherever it's needed. In West Baton Rouge Parish, I'm Avery Davidson for This Week in Louisiana Agriculture. To learn more about the fire ant quarantine, you can visit our website at twilatv.org.